Baltimore, Maryland is home to an impressive group of historic vessels, ranging in size, type, and purpose. On this diamond anniversary of the end of World War II, it is important to note that more than half of those vessels played a role in America's success during the war. One in particular, Liberty Ship SS John W. Brown sits at Pier 13 just around the corner from Fort McHenry. Thousands of Liberty Ships were built as a solution to a major logistical problem during the war. These ugly ducklings, as they are often affectionately referred to, were crewed by U.S. merchant mariners and delivered much-needed munitions, equipment, cargo, and troops to Americans and allies overseas. Today, she is one of only two Liberty ships left operating from World War II. 78 years after her launch, Liberty ship SS John W. Brown continues to serve the community with the help of her all-volunteer crew. Hi, I'm Captain Elena Bassiano, and I've been a volunteer aboard SS John W. Brown since I was just 10 years old. After sailing aboard Liberty ships during the war, my grandfather introduced my older sister and me to the Brown, and the rest, as they say, is history. Not unlike many of our other younger volunteers, John W. Brown influenced and prepared me for a life at sea. Currently, both my sister and I are sailing as captains her as a Sandy Hook Harbor pilot in New York and New Jersey, and myself as a captain on an oceanographic survey vessel overseas. SS John W. Brown was launched September 7, 1942, Labor Day, right here in Baltimore. She was named, appropriately enough, after a labor leader from that era. Operated by a crew of merchant mariners and protected by a small contingency of naval armed guards, the Brown delivered supplies and later was refitted as a troop ship, carrying soldiers and POWs across the Atlantic for the remainder of the war. After the war, SS John W. Brown was repurposed as a maritime vocational high school in New York City, and in 1988 was brought back home to Baltimore by the volunteers of Project Liberty Ship. For the past 32 years, Project Liberty Ship has kept SS John W. Brown alive and steaming. Over two million volunteer service hours have contributed to keeping her lights on and the propeller turning. In addition to restoration, volunteers contribute to the underway operations of the Brown during our annual Living History Cruises. shipyard repair periods, and out-of-state port visits. Also, the crew provides pertinent information to the thousands of visitors that come aboard when the vessel is open to the public each year. The Brown has hosted tours for visitors from places as far-reaching as London and even Australia. One of the more impactful contributions John W. Brown makes to the community is by hosting many educational programs on board. SS John W. Brown volunteers provide a working platform of classes for local maritime union schools, security exercises for local law enforcement, hands-on training for Boy Scout troops, the Corps of Sea Cadets, and local high school STEM students, as well as in-house training to ensure crew proficiency. More recent and very popular programs hosted by Project Liberty Ship are the Steam School and Deck Seaman Experience, where visitors get to stay aboard for a long weekend, attend educational lectures by passionate volunteers, receive hands-on training, and are eventually permitted to operate various ships' equipment. Have you ever lit off a boiler on a 78-year-old steamship? <laughs> Project Liberty Ship SS John W. Brown is so much more than just a piece of America's great history. Current merchant mariners, such as myself, can earn underway days, and engineers can put time on their steam licenses, ensuring proficiency in operation of today's ready reserve fleet, in case American merchant mariners are, once again, required to answer the call in times of modern conflict. SS John W. Brown was born on Baltimore's great waterfront. She continues to operate today with the help of state and federal grants, 
profits from educational and social events, and most importantly, because of generous donations made from people just like you. As we navigate through these uncertain times, your contributions to Project Liberty Ship matter more than ever. Once you step aboard SS John W. Brown, the passion and care taken to keep her afloat becomes obvious. If you find yourself near the Port of Baltimore, stop by and see for yourself, or visit www.sswbrown.org for more information. Thank you, heave ho, and let's keep her steaming.